Hi. Justin, how's it going? Good, how are you? Good, we saw you yesterday. If you saw a group of giggling girls in the gala last night shouting, Justin! Oh. I was in the group. <laughs> you were part of the giggling group? Yes. That's very nice. <laughs> <laughs> we were really excited. Oh, um, who, are you, who are you there with? Just friends? We, I was there as part of uh, Be Seen, which is Britain's East and Southeast Asian network. Um, so we're essentially six angry Asian women who formed last year as a charitable organization to stop Asian hate. So we oh, worked wow. with the government. We got a petition to parliament um, to basically um, stop um, them depicting East and Southeast Asian people in COVID related media. So it's really nice that we get perks like this in light wow. of racism to actually meet people like you so it's so cool oh that sounds like an amazing thing you guys are doing that's awesome oh, thank you so much thank you um so as the northerner i kind of want to speak in a liverpudlian accent for the the lols as homage to ben kingsley in the film which i just found was hilarious um are you are you from that area from Liverpool area. I'm from I'm from Warrington, so I can easily slip into a Liverpoolian accent. Nice. With, yeah, I know. So it was really great to see. <laughs> <laughs> um, but the film was epic. It was really emotional, and I just wanted to personally say thank you to you for bringing this into our lives because as a British Chinese person, it just means so much to me. And I was I was tearing up at so many moments in the film. Um, and I think it's really hard to ignore that with Shang-Chi, it's coming out um, against the backdrop of the global Stop Asian Hate movement. Um, what do you think this type of representation means during a time when our community is globally affected for people in the Asian diaspora? I mean, I... The last movie I did was was with um, Br Brian Stevenson, who is an incredible um, uh, public defense attorney and activist in in the states. And one of the things that that stuck with me that he told me was that you you can't ever understand a person or a problem un unless you allow yourself to get very close to it. And um, I. I do think that that one of the um, un unfortunate reasons for racism and hate is is just ignorance. That um, when you see a, a person, you're just projecting this this stereotype or pre preconceived idea on who they are just by this the way that they look and. Yeah. One of the things that we hope for this movie is that it introduces you to so many different personalities and and um, and characters that are so vastly different from different areas of of the world with their own different cultural backgrounds, um, but they all look like us. Um, and I hope that that it's more difficult for people who watch this movie to carry with them this terrible idea that that all Asians are the same. Um, and, and I hope that they also feel surprised with how much they can relate to each of the characters in our movie. Um, yeah. And that we do share a lot of the same emotions, the same family mm -hmm. drama, the same insecurities yeah. and hopes and dreams. I wanted to get into that with the film. I think it will speak to the Confucian idea of filial piety that we must serve our parents and elders. Um, did you find that you could relate to this experience and did you draw from any personal family experience into your directing? Yeah, the, I mean, I, I think that's just a, a, a pretty co common, not, on, not only in our community, but it's a pretty uh, common conflict that we go through when we're in our 20s, 30s. It's like, we we, t we tend to push away from our parents for a time, and then and then we start to I, I hopefully find a balance where we where we, where we do see that we I mean the, the truth is we are who we are because of because of everything that came before whether it's good or bad or painful or and and uh, there there is a, a a lot of truth to us standing here and being able to have this conversation and these types of pursuits and jobs because of how hard our, our parents did work um, and, and the generations that came before us to get us here. So mm -hmm. I think Shang-Chi is going through that, that balance of, of 
choosing his own path, but also finding respect for those who came before him. Love that answer. Destin, last question. Team rice or team noodles, which one are you? There is a um, right answer here. I'm, I'm typically, I'm always team noodle. I'm yeah! Team noodle. <laughs> That's my team. Yes, got that on record forever. <laughs> Thank you so much, Destin. Okay, thank Legend. you. Legend. <laughs>